everyone and welcome back to our channel the bong diaries as promised i am back with the second part of our exciting shimla series episode i am going to take you all to the captivating world of shimla sightseeing spots which you absolutely cannot miss when you are in shimla along with this i am going to share with you the wonderful experiences and moments that we had on the second day in this beautiful city so let's go second day in shimla we had booked a cab for our sightseeing adventure in the video description i have provided you all with the contact details of the cab bhaiya if you are planning your own shimla manali tour then feel free to reach out to him for a hassle free and enjoyable experience first stop of the day was the renowned jaku temple located at the jaku hill this sacred place holds great significance for both locals and visitors jaku temple dedicated to lord hanuman ji offers a serene atmosphere of spirituality and devotion the temple's vibrant architecture and intricate carvings are a testament to the rich cultural heritage of the region apart from its religious importance Jaku Temple offers panoramic views of Shimla showcasing the breathtaking beauty of the surrounding hills and valleys now one important thing to note over here is be very aware of the monkeys in this place as they have track record of snatching mobiles sweaters purses etc After exploring the serene ambience of Jaku Temple, our next destination was the Rashtrapati Nivas, also known as the Visregal Lodge. To enter the Rashtrapati Nivas, there is an entry fee of rupees fifty for Indian nationals and rupees five hundred for foreign tourists. Additionally, I will recommend you all to take a guided tour of the lodge, and for that there is an additional fee of rupees hundred for Indian visitors and rupees five hundred for international visitors. The guided tour provides valuable insights into the history and architectural marvels of this iconic structure. The lodge witnessed significant historical events, including the deliberations of the Shimla Conference in 1945, where discussions on the partition of India took place. It was also the place where the decision to create Pakistan was made. Walking through these grand halls and beautifully maintained gardens, one can't help but feel a connection to the past and the crucial moments that shaped the destiny of our nation. Today, the Rashtrapati Nivas stands as a magnificent heritage building, housing the Indian Institute of Advanced Study, which promotes academic research and intellectual pursuits. The institute holds seminars, conferences, and exhibitions that contribute to the intellectual discourse of the nation. So, it is a must place that you should visit when you are in Shimla.
Next destination was the Tara Devi Temple. Tara Devi Temple, situated amidst the lush greenery of the Himalayas, is dedicated to Hindu goddess Tara Devi. This revered deity is believed to be an incarnation of goddess Parvati and is worshipped by devotees seeking blessings for peace, prosperity and spiritual upliftment. Moreover, the breathtaking views from the temple premises overlooking the magnificent valleys and distant peaks add to the ethereal experience. was located a mere 250 meters away from Tara Devi Temple. The Dudhadari Temple is dedicated to Lord Rama, one of the most revered deities in Hindu mythology. The temple's name Dudhadari translates to the one who holds a staff made of milk. It is believed that Lord Rama used a staff made of milk during his exile in the forest. The temple's serene surroundings Nested amidst the natural beauty of Shimla, further enhanced the spiritual experience. stop on this exciting journey was Enadil Army Heritage Museum. It was located close to the renowned Enadil Golf Course. Both the destinations offers unique experiences to visitors. The Enadil Army Heritage Museum stands as a tribute to the gallantry and valor of the Indian Army. From ancient weapon to uniforms, photographs and stories of brave soldiers, the museum provides a glimpse into the sacrifices and contributions of the armed forces. Adjacent to Enadil Army Heritage Museum lies the Enadil Golf Course, an iconic sporting destination. It was surrounded by breathtaking natural beauty and this golf course is a heaven for both golf enthusiasts as well as nature lovers. After this, we had returned to Shimla's Mal Road and we treated ourselves to delicious snacks at Shimla Cafe. This cozy restaurant impressed us with its exceptional service, delectable food offerings and, and a very inviting ambience, creating a memorable dining experience. We have spent shopping in Mall Road. One of the shops which I really liked was Lala and Sons, which I really prefer for buying shawls and sweater. In this way, we have spent our two days in Shimla. We shall return back with new videos featuring Manali and Kasol. So make sure to subscribe to stay updated and join me on the next adventure. Until then, goodbye.